When I was a dermatology trainee, I was told that we shouldn't be wearing a wool on sensitive skin. I sat together with a number of my colleagues and we did a detailed literature review on all the reports about the effects of wool on the skin. We found out that in fact, there are many types of wool. Fine fibers, for example, between 19 to 21 or less microns, do not tend to cause the itch sensation. I believe eczema is a very common condition. It's the most common skin condition that we see in children. It can really affect us in many profound ways, especially if severe, but also even mild, moderate cases can be disabling. Current treatments for eczema have their limitations. First is that they're often used reactively just for spots of eczema, and that does not treat the whole of the picture. Current treatments are also complicated by lots of myths in the community and a lot of non-evidence-based practice. Many people with eczema do want something natural because they see it as being safer, more sustainable, better for the environment, better for themselves. We did a randomized controlled crossover study of children between one month and three years with superfine merino wool, comparing its effect on the skin with standard, primarily cotton clothing. Our study assessed the severity of eczema and the score ad includes a measure of sleep disturbance and itch, as well as the localized effects of, on eczema with an ADC score. We also looked at the quality of life of these children and also their use of topical steroids. Our study of superfine merino wool in children showed that during the period of wool wear, there was a significantly greater improvement in eczema and quality of life, as well as less use of topical steroids compared with the period of standard cotton wear.